Well, in business news, the World Bank says it will intensify efforts to provide an alternative source of electricity to underserved populations in the country. This follows its satisfaction with the Rural Electrification Agency and Nigerian Electrification Project Unit deployment and management of the off-grid and mini-grid mass electrification program in rural communities within the Federal Capital Territory. Lara Folayan reports. These off-grid and mini-grid electricity projects are situated in rural communities within the FCT. They are a fallout of the performance-based grant program under the solar hybrid mini-grid component of the Nigeria Electrification Project funded by the World Bank. The World Bank's Director of Strategy and Operations in West and Central Africa is now here to see the impact and effectiveness of the project. I'm very impressed uh, because uh, I think these, um, you, you know, sort of mini grids really will help Nigeria uh, provide access to electricity to many more people faster than it could have done with just extending the national grid. The Power Generation Initiative is aimed at giving electricity to marginalized subpopulations who have long been denied access to power from the national grid. It is against the backdrop of the World Bank and Rural Electrification Agency's commitment to provide in local communities with sustainable electricity access. We are still looking more on productive use uh, and ensuring that uh, we have energy efficient uh, equipment connected to the, to the mini grid. The World Bank assures of its commitment to continuous collaboration with electricity stakeholders in the country towards better access to power, particularly in underserved rural areas. The Rural Electrification Agency also gives the assurance of its dedication to maintaining standardized implementation processes for the effectiveness of the mini grid initiative. We are picking up the communities under the performance based grant. We do this in partnership with the developer. Uh, so, what you find is that uh, developers like NEO are uh, using the current database of uh, unelectrified Nigerians, identified these sort of clusters. So you realize that NEO actually has more than one site here. I hope that in the future we'll see a lot more of that, this connection between the mini-grid and the productive use uh, for mills or for um, other uh, agricultural processing. The benefiting communities say the mini-grids have impacted their quality of life and socio-economic activities. The Nigeria Electrification Project's performance-based grant has aided the deployment of more than 80 of such mini-grids across the country, thereby improving equitable access to electricity. Lara Folayo, TBC News, Abuja.